girlies so today I thought I would bring you an eyeshadow tutorial um, I'm really stumped on the Halloween um, tutorials I have no idea what to do um, so if you got any requests please link that or comment that down in the um, down bar below or the comments below and um, so anyway I just thought I would do another fall edition makeup I think I've only done two which was makeup and or face makeup and I think it was eye makeup so um, anyway, I created this, and this is just in the Maybelline Quad in Cozy Cashmere. Now, if you want to get any of these colors, I suggest getting them now because they are limited edition, and once they are out of stock, they are not going to um, restock them. It's just, it's done until they, um, all the ones that they made are gone. So it just looks like this. It's really pretty, um, and it's just burgundies and kind of a orangish kind of red but like um toned down a bit and just like really frosted white um and anyway sorry and another thing sorry about my voice if this annoys you i am getting sick um i've got like a really stuffy nose so you can be like during the video and i'm so 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 sorry um it, and my voice is kind of going and then it's like <clears throat> you know and coughing and yeah i'm just i'm not feeling well but um, anyway, so I really wanted to create this look, so I hope you like it, and um, let's get on to the tutorial. So I'm going to start off with the base, and this is just my NYX eyeshadow base, and this is in skin tone, and I'm just going to prime my eyelid. And then next, I'm going to use as a base, I'm just going to use the Wet n Wild Ideal Eyes, and this is in Pixie. Just looks like this. I'm going to put this all over my eye as well. So now we're going into the Maybelline um, Eye Studio Eyeshadow Quad, and this is limited edition, and it is in Cozy Cashmere. And then I'm just going to go into this first color. It's like a really frosted kind of champagne kind of color. And I'm just going to get it and I think this is like a concealer brush, but it works great for the eyeshadow. I'm just going to get it on. And I'm going to put this all over my lid. Okay, so next I'm going into the third color, which is this one right here. And I am going to just take a uh, eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to get a little bit onto this brush, about that much. And I'm going to kind of put it on the outer part of my eye, <clears throat> a little bit in the inner part. Kind of like this and kind of blend out the edges. <clears throat> Next, to blend those eyeshadows out, this is the side that we use, so we're just going to flip the brush over, and we are going to go into a first color, right here, <clears throat> and I am just going to do this to blend it out, the um, colors, blend them together, and since we still have eyeshadow on the other side of the red kind of color, kind of put it like that. So it should look like this. Now I'm going into a crease brush and I am just going into the last shade in this quad and I am going to kind of blend it into my crease. To blend out the edges I am just taking a really big fluffy blending brush. So it should look something like this. And now I'm going in with a lip brush, but it would work best if you had a pencil brush, and it just looks like this. And I'm going into the second shade of this palette, and I'm just going to, um, you want to lay the brush flat on its side, like this. You can kind of pick up some of the product, so it should look like that. And now we're just going to kind of work this into the outer V, so I'm just going to press it down like this. And kind of putting a little bit into the crease, putting a little more on the lash line. I didn't um, 
forgot to put it on the lash line in this eye. So it should look like that. And then we are just going to blend it out with this brush again. Very lightly too. And then lightly we're just going to go over the colors like this. Just very, very lightly because you don't want to ruin the eyeshadows and make them look kind of muddy. So it should look like this. Now, in this palette, um, we don't have any eyeshadow colors for the brow bone highlight because this is a little too shimmery and frosted for a brow bone highlight. So all I am doing is I have um, this little e.l.f. palette that customize your own colors. And this is the white color and it's just an ivory. And I'm just going into a El the e.l.f. professional eyeshadow brush. And I'm just going to get that color. And this is going to be my brow bone highlight. Okay, and then I am going into a small, smaller kind of like detail eyeliner brush. And I'm going into this pink kind of color. And it is called Pink Ice. I'm just going to dip the tip into it and put it under on my lower lash line. This really enhances the look. So it should look something like this. And then for eyeliner, I am going into a brown eyeliner just because this is kind of more of a cozy cashmere kind of look. And this is just my Sony Kashuk eyeliner in mahogany. And I'm just going to line my waterline and kind of bring it in my lower lash line just a little bit. Okay, so next I'm going in with mascara, just taking my eyelash curler and curling my lashes. And since this look is not dramatic at all, I tried just going with a um, non-dramatic mascara, and it's just the Maybelline Lash Stiletto one, and this is in um, Blackish Brown. Just applying them to my lashes. And that is the completed eye look. So I hope you like it and um, I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.